Hey friends, welcome back to the channel. Um, I just wanted to start with this video by saying thank you so much for all the likes, comments, shares, and all my new subscribers. Hey, what's up? I'm Brooke, I hope you enjoy the channel, and I have something new today to share with you. Um, <clears throat> this will be more for the ladies, but I'm sure most of you have ladies, and if you don't, you just get to watch me talk about um, carrying in a dress. So, this is kind of a new thing for me. Um, I have done videos in the past on this channel about the comfort concealment belt and how versatile I think it is. I do have previous videos on the channel about it, talking about how I think it's super versatile. Um, but I recently kind of discovered a new way of carrying with it that um, I really, really enjoy. Now, I'm not one to typically wear a ton of dresses, right? So I like shorts and a t-shirt. I like simplicity, but every once in a while we get in a dress. Um, and in the past, I've seen a ton of women go to the thigh holster. Now, with a good trigger guard on that holster, there's absolutely nothing wrong with carrying on the thigh. I know a lot of ladies that don't carry chambered because they're nervous on their thigh, um, or they do use a trigger guard, which helps protect the trigger at the same time. But I can't tell you just how many people I've seen carrying in thigh holsters with no trigger protection, just that cloth over it, it scares me. Um, I think the most, you know, the safest way to carry a gun on your person would be to make sure your trigger is absolutely covered. Kydex is I feel like the only option as far as I feel comfortable. So I wanted a new way to carry in a dress where I could feel one, safe and two, comfortable um i i just i'm not a big fan of thigh holsters like i said i feel like the kydex bumps it up so it's even more bulky you're trying to conceal i feel like you're kind of working against yourself so for me when i discovered the comfort concealment belt and wearing clothes underneath of your dress so i do wear biker shorts under my dress i was able to one carry on my comfort concealment belt with my favorite kydex holster and feel super safe and secure the comfort concealment belt is tight to the body. It allows me to carry Kydex and carry comfortably in a dress. Now, I feel like the combination of all those things have really pushed my dress game to the next level. So you'll notice me wearing more dresses because I'm confident carrying them. You know, making this choice five years ago to carry on body was something that I really, really wanted to become more and more and more versatile with. Um, so. I'm gonna stand up here in a minute. I will demo this um, outfit I have today on and show you what it's all about. Um, but like I said, ladies, if you're watching this, men, if you wanna pass this along to your ladies, awesome. Um, carrying in a dress, get some cheap biker shorts. You can get them anywhere, just about anywhere. They have them everywhere. Tight to the body, compression shorts underneath the dress. Two, this belt system I'll show you, comfort concealment. Watch the previous video if you have any questions about it as well. And to get yourself a comfortable carry and a comfortable holster that you can safely wear in a dress that's not printing. You will notice today I'm wearing a printed dress. This dress is also flowy and you will see it when I stand up. Both of those things I've also talked about in previous videos where patterns are good things to hide, you know, your everyday carry, this kind of does it all. So we got patterns, we got flowy dress, and we got a good setup. So I'm gonna stand up here in a second and I will show you guys what it's all about. Okay guys, I'm back. So as you can see today, I have a dress on. Um, I've told you a little bit about the carry setup here. So we're wearing a pattern dress, patterns hide guns, patterns hide your carries. I can't say it enough that patterns are your best friend. No matter if you're male or female, you'll see, I see a lot of people, especially when we're transitioning into fall time wearing flannels and you know, things like that to that degree. So Patterns are your best friend. This dress has a pattern and this dress is completely flowy. So we're not, you know, nothing's hugging tight to the body, which we love. If I'm gonna wear a dress, it's gotta be flowy most of the time. It's hard to conceal anything in that. So I'm gonna show you the setup here. So I have my Glock 43X. I'm gonna step closer to the camera. So Glock 43X, this is my Allegiant holster. It's got the overhook, so it's hooking nice and snug to my comfort concealment belt. And as you can see, I'll show you a little bit here. As you can see, this is tight up against the body. I have it just slightly off appendix, just because something right in the front is a little bit harder to conceal. This is a little bit off center from appendix carry, but it works for this concealment option. 
So I have the comfort concealment belt on, as you can see, do a little front view here. Comfort concealment belt is on. I do have biker shorts on. These are super important with this outfit because it keeps things snug to the body, keeps this belt, as you can see, no belt loops here, ladies or gentlemen, um, but it keeps us nice and secure. So I got the Glock 43X here. This is super comfortable with this outfit. I have no issues whatsoever and it's hooked to my comfort concealment belt. So as you can see, I'm gonna put the dress back over. We're super flowy, readjust everything because you have to. And everything's nice and snug. So as you can see, this dress has these little ruffles. It helps to conceal this gun. I really, really don't have any issues with it. Um, if you know anybody that you wanna share this with, make sure you share this video with them. I have a ton of different concealment options I'll be bringing to you guys as we go. I have a new belt on its way, so stay tuned for that. I appreciate all of you. And if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, guys. I appreciate each and every one of you, and I can't wait to bring you in the next video. Have a good day, guys.